What's good, y'all? It's Cam Dion, and y'all already know why I'm here, okay? So listen, Normani released a new song Friday, didn't even know, it didn't make any noise. Are we surprised with that? Mm, not really. The song is called 159 featuring Gunna. I wanted to see what it was giving. So let's get into it. <laughs> Okay, going on. Girl, I really didn't even realize this was gonna at first. Not even gonna lie. I was sitting here like, who is this? I really didn't know what she was saying in her verses. So I need the enunciation to be a little better. The only thing that was really like, that stuck out the most to me was the chorus. Boy, what you gonna do with this? Whatever she said. I like that part. I like that part. But the verses, um, it's a no for me with the verses. It's a no. I don't really understand what she's saying. I don't. Is this a bad song? I wouldn't say this is a bad song. I think a lot of people was probably kind of overreacting a little bit when they were saying that this was a chop. I mean, is it a chop? Yeah, I think it's a chop. <laughs> I like the chorus though. I really do. I honestly and truly, I was shocked to hear Ghana like singing like that. Um, I didn't realize that was Ghana at first. I didn't. And I'm looking at the screen like to say feature Ghana, where is Ghana? I don't wanna say it's a new sound that Ghana do because I don't listen to Ghana in full like that to know if he's doing new sounds, but from the songs that I personally know by Ghana and personally listen to by Ghana, he doesn't sound like this on any of his songs. So I do like his verse. I do like I do like his sound, his verse for sure. I like that. That's something different. Hmm. Clearly Ghana couldn't save the song seeing that it didn't even debut on the Spotify charts, but you know, hey. <laughs> What can I say? Personally, I just feel like Normani's time has passed. I feel like Normani's time was around motivation. Normani had everybody on their toes when she dropped motivation, including me. Not anymore. Honestly, I'm just not interested in her anymore. I'm sorry. Like, I really went, I was really going up for her, but she's lost the fire. She lost her touch. Sorry. It's not there anymore. It's just not there anymore for me. I don't feel like she knows who she is as an artist or even as a person, but that reflects in your artistry as well. <laughs> in her defense, she is someone that come from a girl group. I feel like she probably didn't have many opportunities to really express herself how she can solo. So it's like, I'm sure she's discovering newer things about herself, I'm sure. Like, I'm sh like, I feel like her in a group, she didn't have a chance to discover who she really was, who she really is. Um, so I will say that I'll, in her defense, I will say that. But you've been solo since what, 2018? We're in 2024 and you're just now about to give us a solo album, your debut album. Nah, I'm not sure if. No money doesn't realize the hype is gone. I don't know. I think social media has her fooled a little bit too. That's why I'll be telling you guys, social media is not a real place. It's not a real place. Just because someone is going up for you on social media does not mean that they're gonna support your music. And that's exactly what we're seeing with No Money. There's a lot of people online that go up for her, but when it's time to support her music, they're nowhere to be found. That's why I don't take you people serious. I don't support these people in real life. So I'm going to say whatever I want because it's my opinion and it's how I feel. Whether you like it or you don't, it's going to get said. <laughs>
like this whole entire rollout of this album that No Money is pushing, honestly, to be honest, I don't think nobody's really asking for it. I don't think it's something that people are truly excited for. I don't, I don't really think it is because I don't see it. I don't see the excitement. And clearly y'all don't either, seeing that, like I just said, it didn't even debut on the Spotify charts. I'm sorry, it's just not looking too hot for her. It's not. People are not receiving your snippets, your singles, like they're not receiving that pretty well. So I don't really know how they're gonna receive an album. I don't know, I don't know. So you guys should let me know down in the comments below. What did you think about this song? Did you like it? Did you not like it? You guys should also let me know if you're looking forward to her debut solo album, honey, okay? And what you think it's gonna give. I really feel like it's gonna be a snooze fest. I'm sorry. It's gonna really be a snooze. Yikes. Thank you guys for always tuning in to me. Thank you for supporting, subscribing, commenting, sharing, liking, honey, all of the above, okay? I appreciate it. Thank you so much. If you are new here, please don't forget to subscribe because honey, we get into some things over here every Monday and Friday, okay? Also, please don't forget to check out camdiontalks.com. Honey, I have my blog page set up over there. And you also can catch my recent YouTube videos over there as well, honey. And the schedule for Cam Dion Talks podcast season two will be on there, okay? So you don't want to miss that, okay? So go on over there, subscribe to the email list, honey. Go ahead and check that out, okay? Because you don't want to miss it, okay? Love you so much. I hope you have a great rest of your day.